back to uh, you as a young man watching his fight in uh, the Congo. Yes, interesting, the Rambo in the jungle. Paul, I woke up around 3 a.m. because uh, the march was supposed to be broadcast live from Kinshasa uh, in Central Africa around 4 a.m. Uh, East African Standard Time. I am watching uh, this fight. But to be very honest with you, I was a very interested watcher. I was a very interested uh, type of guy because I was a fan of Muhammad Ali. Uh, I was the type of person who believed that he was indeed the best, the greatest. And I was the type of guy who believed that no one could actually beat him, even if he was beat. But you know, several years later, I have the opportunity to meet Muhammad Ali when I'm a, an, I'm a, I am an undergraduate student in upstate New York. He talked about power can be so intoxicating just in the same way that drugs, in fact, can make somebody get high, get stoned, just in the same way that alcohol can do the same thing to a human being. He said, that is power. And I looked at him, I admired my hero. But this time it was different because guess what? We were breathing the same airport in the same building, in the same hall, upstate New York in Albany. Mm -hmm.